Howdy folks, I'm Eric and today we're headed to Lake Wenatchee State Park. Lake Wenatchee State Park is located in the Alpine Peaks of the North Cascades in Washington State, about 20 minutes west of the Bavarian Wunderland, Leavenworth. Featuring a sprawling glacier-fed lake, a quaint mountain setting, and a dry climate, Lake Wenatchee State Park is a great family getaway for a fun weekend. Now, usually I try to insert some nice drone footage into this part of the review, but on this trip, I just couldn't. Our trip to Lake Wenatchee State Park was both literally and figuratively overshadowed by dense wildfire smoke pollution. The airspace needed to be kept clear for firefighting aircraft, and for the first time in our camping history, we had to cut our trip short because the air quality was just that bad. Now, this was our fifth summer in a row camping in this area, and we have never seen it this bad. The smoke actually drifted all the way down here to Seattle, and it enveloped most of Washington State. As global temperatures continue to rise, this is a good reminder of the profound effect that people can have on our environment, and that it's up to all of us to be good stewards of our planet. Anyway, back to the review. Lake Wenatchee State Park has a staggering 197 campsites split into two campgrounds. The north campground is definitely the quieter of the two. Its campsites are split into two rings and any campsite on the outer side of each ring is worth your while. The south campground is where the action is. It features a playground, a beach, a general store, and horseback riding nearby. If you have kids, you'll probably want to be on the South Campground. For the South Campground, we recommend sites 73 through 88. There are some real stinker campsites at this campground, but this stretch offers more privacy and is a little bit separated from the rest of the campground. For our money, the top site at Lake Wenatchee State Park is site number 74. We lucked into this site on our recent trip and we couldn't have been happier with it for its space and its privacy. Site 88 was a close second. The park's namesake, Lake Wenatchee, offers swimming, kayaking, paddleboarding, and boating. The swimming area is really, really popular and it can get really crowded, but the beach is big enough that you shouldn't have any trouble finding a spot for the day. The water is glacier made, so it is cold, but that can be a really nice contrast on those hot summer days. If you forget your kayak or your paddleboard at home, there are rentals available. And if you need a floaty, you can buy one along with some ice cream at the general store. Every time we've camped at Lake Wenatchee State Park, we've had trouble with insects. The first time, it was bees. The second time, mosquitoes. This time, it was bees and mosquitoes, which is quite an epic combo. So make sure that you bring something to keep those bugs at bay. The thing that keeps us coming back to this area year after year is the charming town of Leavenworth. This beautiful city has a local ordinance that requires all buildings to be constructed and adorned in ye old Bavarian style. This creates an ambiance that jettisons you off to Europe right in the middle of Washington state. There are plenty of places to get delicious German fare anywhere in the city, but our favorite is the Leavenworth Sausage Garden. You just can't beat its spread of wieners, mustards, and beer. Stop by its adjacent sister store, Cured, for some awesome charcuterie. I can't recommend the buckboard bacon enough. To beat the heat, check out the Hopkins Memorial Leavenworth Community Pool. This saltwater pool has a lively waiting area for small kids, and it's big enough to tire out kids of all ages. Another way to cool off is to float the river. Now, we recommend the Leavenworth Outdoor Center to help you out with this. They'll put you in a van and drive you two miles upriver and then let you float at your own pace back to Leavenworth. This is truly one of my favorite activities ever. Just make sure that you book early 
because walk-up appointments aren't usually available. And lastly, there is a wonderful sandy beach along the river just outside of town. Keep an eye out for the turnoff because it comes and goes quickly. This beautiful beach is the perfect place for a picnic or an entire afternoon. So there you have it. That's Lake Wenatchee State Park in a nutshell. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, post them in the thread below. Now go be a happy camper. For more campsite reviews, subscribe to this channel or check out aerocamping.com.